Well, first cousin marriage will probably be illegal soon in Tennessee, but not without a fight. Thank you for joining us for News 2 at 4. I'm Mark Kelly. A Republican lawmaker defended cousin marriages today after saying his own grandparents were first cousins. State Capitol reporter Chris O'Brien explains. Yes, it's currently legal for two first cousins to marry in Tennessee, but soon that will likely change. First cousins in the state of Tennessee, you, you can't marry first cousins. We're not going to allow that in this day and age. Thursday, the General Assembly passed a bill banning marriage between lineal descendants of a grandparent. Currently, the law only outlaws marriage between just the children of a grandparent. The bill passed unanimously in the Senate and drew support from most Republicans in the House, but not all of them. There's an additional risk, but it's not as significant as some might otherwise be led to believe. Brentwood Republican Representative Gino Bolso filed an amendment to protect cousin marriage if couples see a genetic counselor. Obviously the way he did it we didn't agree with and so his amendment failed um, and should have. Bolso argued a ban on first cousin marriages would violate the Supreme Court case Oberfell v. Hodges which legalized gay marriage. Obergefell was a grievously wrong decision. Is there a public health issue with a male marrying a male first cousin? Obviously, I think the answer is no. Uh, I think he was misinterpreting the Obergefell decision to try to keep um, first cousin marriage legal in the state of Tennessee, which is an interesting position to take. It's a bit of an about face from Bolso, who last week said he planned to support the bill despite the history of his own grandparents. And they were first cousins, but they couldn't get married in Ohio. So back in, in 1924, they actually came down to Tennessee <laughs> to get married. Uh, <laughs> House Republican leadership say Bolso was just trying to show the irony between the bill and the Oberfell ruling, since the bill would also outlaw LGBTQ marriages between first cousins. The hypocrisy is kind of ironic on that, to have a Democrat filing a bill saying they're limiting who can get married when they've been pretty clear that they're fine with certain liberals, with polygamy and with whomever marrying whoever. In Nashville. Chris O'Brien. All right, so the bill now heads to the governor's desk, but the numbers are there to overturn even if he vetoes.